video for the rolling game. Here is the blue note box. It says, you need to select the reduced percentages for three stages. Stage 4 percentage will be adjusted automatically so the finished size will be near 0 .0625. At each stage the product can be reduced to from 40% of its size to 60% of its size. Each step is 1% change. Well down here we see these rows refer to stage 1, stage 2, stage 3, and stage 4. And above are the percentages from 40 to 60. And this says it's the stage cost for reduced to percentage. You are to minimize your total. It starts at 50 percent for each stage to check your total toggle work total well first we see over here your total right now it says is 3702 and down here marked in yellow it shows that you have so far selected the reduction of 50 50 50 and 50 and here you see Underneath percentage 50 is all four of the stages. And it said we could toggle the work total. I'm going to toggle it now. I'm just going to click on it. And here it says it found a cost of 3623 That is, this was figured out by the computer working on the total. Right? To make a change, click on cost in the stages row and the percentage column. It's yellow highlighted. Well, down here we saw the selections are yellow highlighted. Now you only get to select the first three stages. Remember the last one automatically adjusts itself to make sure it gets this answer over here a point zero six two five so now it's set cost of three thousand seven hundred and two what if I change this I move that so it at fifty one percentage but look what happened the bottom one had to go lower in order to to make it stay at 0 0.0625 and as I change it up here you see it changes again because it has to make sure that these percentages end up with the right size but we were reducing the cost at 36.85 36.78 and that's what you have to do you have to go down here and and make changes to reduce your total cost. Now there are 100 games and they are numbered 0 to 99. I'm now going to change it to game number 1 so I have to click on it to highlight it and I'll put a 1 in that position. This is a different game and I can go all the way up to game 99. This is game 99. Notice it always starts out with each thing being at 50%, which means it'll get reduced to 0 0.0625. And here we see the beginning numbers. If we toggle the answer over here, it tells us 47, 55, 60, and 40.3. And down here we'll see blue marks next, uh, blue, I'm sorry, black marks next to the positions it shows. Here's 47. We could choose 47. The next one's 55. We can choose 55. And the last one it says is 60. Here's 60. 
And notice now we get the same answer as over here at the work total. Your total and the work total are the same. Now it also says I can click to go to another note. I'll click on next. If the finished size of 0.0625 cannot be made, your total will not be displayed. This is because the first three stages did not reduce the size enough or the size was reduced too much. In other words, it couldn't get to the value of 0.0625 no matter well, what it could do down here for the fourth stage has to be between 40 and 60 percent in the reducing. Also it says here when the game number is changed only the cost for stage 2 and stage 3 are changed. Here we notice the row for stage 2 and stage 3. Stage 1 which would be the roller number 1 its costs don't change. And stage four, these costs don't change. All right, I can go click back to go back to the first note. Now I'm going to click up here under program. Here is the main program for rolling. And if we go over here to this list, it says there is only one sub program to rolling that says it's run the rolling mill. All right, so there's only two actual programs involved. Up here at the top in these blue boxes are options you can take. Execute the application would take us back. Save the application. Create a new application if we want. Create a new sub-program. Then it would add it to this list down here. These others are about copying data from this particular app or copying data from another app and placing it into this app. Now down below here in these brown boxes are functions that help to make the programs. Here for instance you can list the values, you can list the text, you can change the names of things. Several places to do that comments and captions. You can learn about the, the control registers, ASCII and colors, things that you need to be able to change, including sounds, font sizes, and whatnot. Below this is a list of YouTube videos It'll tell you how to build an app, create it, save it, copy things, make changes, and actually make an HTML file for your app. Below that is a, a link that will run an app that will explain the use of a lot of the actions that are used in this P code. This is a P code. Below that is a list of HTML5 P code YouTube videos about the building of apps. These instruction lines and instruction parts list the values, the page text, what you need to know to actually make an app. All right, I'm going to go up to the blue box that says execute the application, and here I go back to the application. What you got to understand is the same P code engine that runs this app is the same P code engine that created it and that can create other apps. And down below here it says this is a list of HTML5 P code apps. Here we have one called Bakery, Blackjack, Box Delivery, Colorful, and so forth. Many P code apps. All right, this is the end of the YouTube video about the rolling game.